Hey everybody, Michelle Media here with this little guy, Don Juan. George is back there. And this little guy here, if you guys haven't seen him yet, this little guy is Travieso. He's my little Siamese kitty. He's burned, he's comfy, he wants to take a nap. All right, uh, today we have a wonderful Dollar Tree haul for you, so let's dive right into it and let's look about, um, I don't know, a few minutes or so at 10 items that I found in the last haul um, that I uh, found at my trip to Dollar Tree. Okay, first and foremost, here I found this set, complete set, the oven mitt, the uh, pot holders, set of two, and the kitchen towel. These say stay positive. Isn't that fabulous? I, you know I had to have it, you know, being an animal lover and my little guys here. Isn't this just great? And I can say that I've never had any uh, negative, uh, you know, um, characteristics of these items. You know, they've lasted quite a long time. And uh, I like that they have so many pieces with the same, you know, fonts and the same theme on them. So these were great. And one more thing that goes with them, though, the placemats. Look at that. And these, you can actually do all kinds of stuff with, you know, you can frame them. Just, you don't actually have to use any of the uh, Dollar Tree items that I show you, you know, for its intended purposes, just as long as it's within means of safety, okay? Uh, but isn't that cute? Oh, you know I had to have it. And I love that they're slick and you can, you know, just uh, easily wipe them off. So I was glad to get the entire set. I usually get like four complete, um, not sets, but four uh, placemats to have enough for my set. Okay, now. Next, we have these really giant liquid drink containers, or you can use them for other stuff too, but nevertheless, look at it. These remind me of like the big gulps, you know, from the corner stores. This says, hello, summer, and it has watermelon and lemon and lime. Isn't that just wonderful? I love these drinks because we're always, you know, drinking corner store drinks that uh, have uh, big cups. And look at this one. Is that not wonderful? And it even has the texture I don't know if you can quite see it but it has a diamond shaped texture as if it's a real ice cream cone and a strawberry ice cream and a heavy-duty straw that goes with it so I was glad to get some of these I wanted several of these but this is all they had so I grabbed them perhaps I'll have some again and I'll be able to grab another one for the pair okay now let's show you this this is a 12 inch wreath, so it says it's 12 inch, but nevertheless, it is a uh, <clears throat> bamboo wreath. And again, they only had one. Of course, us DIYers, we uh, love to have several of the same, but I went ahead and grabbed it because I don't know if my locations will ever have these again. But I love these. You know, I mean, there's so much possibilities for DIYs or Heck, if you want to leave it as is or just add a little something or the other. And, um, yeah, so grab them. Definitely, because these, for some reason, they're rare. Okay. Next, you guys are going to love this one. This is the uh, candy jar with lid. Look at that. I have been looking for these, have not found them. Lo and behold, there were like, um... I believe there were like three of them on the shelf. I grabbed two of them. Oh my goodness, I love, love, love these. You take off the lid and it sits on its side. See how it's angled? And it's a pretty good size one. You can get these at, you know, perhaps the other, you know, box stores, brand new and a set made out of glass, the expensive kind. But these are just as good and Chances are they won't shatter like the glass one, so I'm sure you'll enjoy these. So, again, another coveted item to look out for. Okay, so I had a pair of those. And let's see here. Um, look at this, how cute. This dentist kit. I thought it would be cute to make a sign 
Um, it's got the uh, teeth, the tray, the uh, toothbrush, some tongs, and some kind of a clamp-like scissors. Isn't that cute? I don't know if you can see that. I don't know if you guys recall my previous haul where I had something similar, but it was kitchen items, uh, like food, and I thought it would be cute to make a kitchen sign, and this would be cute to make like a little uh, DIY dental sign or bathroom sign for hygiene, you know? I mean, look how cute. You must have it. Okay, now, you guys, you know, you know, you want it. The giant planters, terracotta and a taupe color. And um, I don't know if you can see, they are textured in like a, a line, kind of a brush stroke all the way around the planter. And then it's got some like rippled effect line on the top. Look how huge they are. Just so great. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna use them as a planter or not, but I am going to use them and I grabbed like four of these because again, I doubt I'll see them again. So let's see what else. Oh, you ladies are going to love this. I got two of these, two packages. These are the uh Barrette clips by uh, Scunchy, and they're called Sincerely Jewels. The and they're gold tone, by the way. The first one is like an iridescent orange-like color, and the second one is a green and purple. I don't know if you can see that, but isn't that just great? I got two pairs of those because I know that'll hold my hair. My hair is kind of heavy and thick, so I have to have something strong for that. I love these, I love the color, they're so great. So, any of these items, guys, if you have hauled them already, let me know in the comments below and let me know how, how it's worked out for you or what you're using them for. And uh, any ideas, you know, share with us. Okay, I got those. And, let's see, I have something else that you guys, I know you're gonna love this too. These are, Matchbox cars. Matchbox cars. <laughs> um, this one is a Junior Mints. If you find these, grab them because they go pretty fast. The ones that have like name brand promotional items. This is a Junior Mints. This is like the candy series. Uh, this one is Charms. See that? Isn't that not cute? And then this one is the Tootsie Roll Pop. How fabulous, you know? Okay. And the last two are the dots. Come on, who wouldn't want that man cave, your cave, his cave? Oh, who cares, just get them. Okay, and this one is the sugar daddy. Isn't that wonderful? Cameraman, don't you like it? Uh, Cameron, hello? Yeah, yeah, that's awesome. Okay. <laughs> my sugar daddy behind the <laughs> camera anyway <laughs> this is great and our last item for the evening are these mugs I know some of you may have hauled them already but nevertheless I finally found them at my store this is be kind it's got the same graphic on the front and the back and it's got the bee with the uh, beehive honeycomb shape says be kind this one says when life gives you lemons make lemonade is that not cute come on you can't live without it okay and the third one here is the let your dreams blossom the coveted blue truck with the flowers back and front look at that isn't that cute is that not cute? Oh, and I forgot, we do have one more item to show you. Anyway, these are so great. I've got like two of each, because I love to have, you know, my cups and my, um, and my glasses and at least pairs, anywhere from four to a pair, so depending on what's available. So there were plenty left on the shelf, but I'm sure by now they're probably either gone or close to gone, so 
another item to grab if you see it. And one more item I want to talk to you guys about is a companion book to the um, TV show on PBS called Victoria about the life and times of Queen Victoria. Um, this is a hardback book that was uh, valued at $29.99. Here you go. Beautiful cover. This is the front and this is the back of her with her big flowy dress. This is such a wonderful book. So if you saw this series on PBS, I would definitely recommend grabbing this quickly if you hurry on down to your Dollar Tree and uh, you know find it because these were not in a um, in a generous amount on the shelves. There were very very few. So I did get a couple of these. So in my next haul, I will update you guys and let you know if I have any left. I did uh, you know think about giving them away as gifts, but. Um, I'll let you know if I ended up keeping some and if I have any available so in case you guys might want to inquire about them. Nevertheless, they are such pretty, pretty pictorials about the um, life and uh, um, the life and uh, uh, efforts of the uh, monarchy in Queen Victoria's time. So many pretty pictures. Oh my goodness, you guys, it, this is just such a beautiful book. I love it. I absolutely love it. Behind the scenes, um, input, insight from the actors. I mean, this is just a great, great book as a companion to the show on PBS. So guys, what did you think of today's haul? And let me know what you got. And if there's anything you want me to look out for you, let me know. And uh, I'd love to hear from you. You know, give me a, a, you know, a comment or two, you know, and I'd appreciate a thumbs up and, you know, the whole routine. Uh, I uh, want to give my gratitude to all of you for supporting me and subscribing. So stay tuned because next week I will have another giveaway. You're going to want to see that. So until tomorrow or the next day, which I will be working on my next haul. Let me get, let's see, who do I have here? DJ's with me. So DJ and I would like to say a farewell to everybody supporting our channel. And we hope to see you here back again, okay? So talk to you later, guys. Bye.